Hello, I'm Dr. Valentin Dublianu. I'm a periodontist practicing in Toronto, Ontario, and in this video I'll be discussing scaling and replaning. Scaling and replaning is also known as supportive periodontal therapy and non-surgical periodontal treatment. Scaling and replaning is the least invasive and most cost-effective manner in which we can maintain healthy gums and teeth. This treatment involves careful cleaning of the root surfaces to remove trap, plaque, and calculus, also known as tartar, from within the pockets. Local anesthetic may be administered when indicated in order to allow the procedure to be as comfortable and pain-free as possible, and to allow the dental cleaning instrument, or curette, to access the deepest part of each pocket. The majority of disease-causing bacteria are removed with this treatment. Continuous maintenance therapy on a six-month recall will be enough to maintain healthy gums for most patients. For patients with periodontal disease, a four-month or even three-month recall may be recommended until the condition is stabilized. Why is scaling and root planing so important? Well, the main cause of gum disease is bacterial plaque, an adherent whitish film that continuously reforms on our teeth. The bacteria in this plaque produces toxins that constantly attack our teeth and gums. Until plaque is removed, it will harden into a rough crystal-like deposit called calculus. Thorough daily brushing and flossing uh, techniques are effective in minimizing the formation of calculus, but they will not completely prevent it. Regardless of how effective we are at brushing and flossing, bacterial plaque will cause recurrence of gum disease two to four months after the last scaling and replaning. Periodontal disease is the most common cause of tooth loss in adults. You will be able to keep dental costs down and prevent future problems if you stick to a scaling and replaning schedule recommended by your dentist or periodontist. This commitment will help you maintain better oral health for a lifetime. Thank you.